<laughs> How's it going, Slayers? Today we're doing Saw. And yeah. I'm just gonna move this camera back. Just there we go. It's not that loud either, yada yada. New game up. Oh, hard drive. Alright. New save game. Yes, I wanna do a new save game. Yeah, I'm gonna do insane. Psych. Yeah, I wanted to play a game too. That's why I'm playing my Xbox, you dumbass. Why do you think I bought the game, bro? Yeah, it's October. So, uh, yeah. Is it seriously supposed to be, like, not that loud? Like, the real. I wanted, I, I had to unplug my lamp. It was freaking good glare. Dude, look at this dude. He's Obama. Some scary stuff, bro. I I already know <laughs> how to do this first part. Oh, dude, that would suck. Where are you, Jigsaw? I won't play your game. I won't. I already know how to do this first part. Over here, there's a door with a lock on it. And uh, it's a combination lock, obviously. What you gotta do is you gotta you see these red markets, you gotta shut these. Uh, shut that. That's obviously a freaking four. And then you look at the mirror, and you gotta line it up like. Uh, hold up. It's 437. There you go. Bam. Bam. Combination lock. Four. Three. And a seven. Oh! Oh god. Alright, this is... Oh my god, dude. I'm getting scared. There's a camera right there. If you press Y, you got a lighter. Man, I'm getting scared right now. Oh my gosh, bro. Oh shit, what did you do? Don't turn that up. Escaping this room will require teamwork. Activating the panel will open both doors. Detective Dab, you must first find the object in the toilets to unlock the panel. As for the toilet, I've gathered refuse from the obsessions of drug addicts. Now, detective, dig through others' discarded trash as you forced others to dig through yours. If either one of you fails in your task, the bombs in this room will detonate. I suggest you hurry. Bruh. 
Uh, I think it's this one. Oh, never mind. This one, here we go. Yeah, look, there's the fuse. God. Man, dude, that would suck, man. I can't. Mm -mm. Yes, I get it. Insert. Without record time. See, why does he leave without me? We could have gone together. Stupid ass. Oh, wait, never mind. Shit, look. Getting across that glass is gonna hurt. You aren't getting my shoes. You dick. See, look, he couldn't wait for me. Like, are you serious? You're supposed to slowly walk over the glass. Or else you'll, uh, get hurt. You'll get hurted. Alrighty then. Oh wait, yeah, hold on. There's, uh, oh, there's health. How about that? There we go. I don't want to use it yet. Am I able to go in his room? Uh, I think there might be something. Oh, never mind. Look for stuff to search. Stuff to search. So, well, I just keep going then. But the song is dark. Oh my god, man. Uh-uh, uh-uh. Oh my Jesus, this dude's dead. Oh damn. You guys have be oh. oh. He looked like he had a good day. I'll just, uh, I'll, I'll just keep out of his business. Your bro, get right. Why does he gotta leave me? Oh my god. I remember when I first played this game. Oh my god, that scared the crap out of me. I was like nine. It was when this game first came out, dude. I was, oh my god. <laughs> I jumped so hard. Because the pig is basically the only scary thing that actually, like, scares me. Why does my health bar keep coming up? Am I walking over glass? Oh, read case file. April 3rd, 1885, construction has completed on the Whitehurst Asylum for the insane. We've completely, er, bruh, we finally done it. I have told all staff that awesome. Man, I'm stupid. But I believe it bears repeating. I think we can make a real difference here. We can change lives. I think each and every one of you, <clears throat> for your, um, contribution, sincerely, Daniel Whitehurst, MD. Alright. See, you see, you, you guys are lucky I'm reading that for you. Oh my Jesus Christ. Oh my God, man. I'm gonna turn this on because on camera. Shut up, man. I'm trying to record. Jesus Christ. Look at this dude. He's dead. Shut up. Jesus. Yeah, I am. I'm not gonna save you. Don't be quiet, man. You're ruining my freaking video. Oh my god, dude. I gotta read. I gotta read this too. All right. 
June 2nd, 1885. Uh, Whitehurst Asylum for the Insane is now open for patients. Or patients of the most distressed and violent natures. After my father took his own life due to mental illness, I vowed to aid the mental rehabilitation of every um, troubled soul that needed help. The asylum will be the forerunner of medical treatments, traditional and experimental. Sincerely, Daniel Whitehurst, MD. Alright, so let's keep on with the game. Bro! What are you doing? Sorry, buddy. This is part of my game. Nothing personal. I'd grab something quick, though, if I was you. Bro, why would you hit me and just walk away? An idiot. Oh, damn. Alright. Alright, the hitting and stuff in this game always confuses me. Alright, A is light attack. X is... Oh, B is for block. Okay. Boy. Wow. Ow, man, I'm sorry. I blocked. That didn't work. Oh, get your... Get your ass moved. Shot. Get your freaking dome blown off. Scrubs, man. Freaky, man. What a scrub. Look at him. He walked in there. He got his ass blown off. Jesus Christ. Right, his door's sealed. Let's see what this guy had. There's a note. Oh my freaking god. Okay, it's by G. Sella. Many of you are wondering how to escape this place. The answer is simple. Find Detective Debate. David, David Tapp. I have concealed the key inside his body. The key is your only escape. Do what you must to survive. Man, screw you. Putting keys inside me. Fucker. Just gonna unlock this door. I'm just gonna close it behind me just in case, because I'm scared. Oh god, that's like, oh my, I almost walked in that. Oh, checkpoint boy. Shotgun doors. Jigsaw has booby trapped. The door is in the asylum. Quickly press the appropriate button to... Oh yeah, I already, I already knew this. Why? See, if I press X or something, I would've walked in and went poof, and got my head blown off. That would not be funny. Lockpick. I don't have no freaking nail. Yet. Let's open up this door. God damn. Oh, get cut, boy. Oh my god, dude. Wouldn't that be Pokemon? It's on, it seems you were sloppy and and got shot. I had to repair your wound, you will live, but during the operation, I used the, op the opportunity to conceal a key inside your body. The key is useless to you, but not to the others. Here. I doubt any of them have the surgical experience to... Required to extract a key without killing you. Oh my god, dude. Okay, I stopped there for a second. My freaking my cat Foxy is touching my stand. No, Foxy, don't knock over the camera, please. <laughs> uh, yeah, all right. Bandages. Okay, I thought that was another note. I was about to get pissed off, man. I don't want to read again. What was that? Something popped up, but okay. Well, I got the mail now. Let's get the poop out of here. Alright, th these are pretty... Oh, frick. Alright, these are pretty simple. Wait a second. Okay, okay. I was like, wait a second. There we go. Why does my blood keep popping up? Or my health, I mean. Oh. I'm just gonna back away. What's that? Okay, I thought that was a note. There's like a million of notes playing around. That dude got wrecked by a bunch of barbed wire, man. Sucks for you. 
Audio tape. Not all my subjects There's a freaking file! Oh. Alright, there we go. So I have to read this note for you. Regarding all oh, your asylum surgical procedures. Triangle for your patient. Wait, what? Try. Oh, triage. Okay, your patient's. Patient with bite wounds is not important as a patient. Oh my god, he got bit by a zombie. That, re that requires an immediate uh, appendectomy. If a repeat offender, the bite wound patient can be safely ignored until major surgery is required. Yeah, until he eats you. Anyways, sterilize your equipment. Studies show that patients may not eat on it. Doses of antibiotics after surgery with sterile tools. Antibiotics are expensive. Only antibiotics, I mean, only use oplets on. Uh, wait, oplets? I don't care, man. On um, patients that require them, mental illness may cause some patients to not react to pain at all. Use this to your advantage. Alrighty, boy. Getting scared now, I'm gonna drink this water. Even though I'm not freaking drinking it. Video game logic. Both are from other side, what a fucker. Oh my god, dude. My name is Rose, I am 8 years old. My mommy says I have polio. Polio is bad, I have it worse than Uncle Jack. He can still walk though, he seems drunk. So I am now in his machine. It breathes, it breathes for me, so, uh, so they call it an iron lung. The nurse says she will write what I say once, once a day so my diary doesn't forget who I am. She's my only friend. Alright, let's do this. And I'm tired of all this reading. Can action just happen like this? Well, that dude's dead. Jesus Christ, man. Where am I? Oh, okay. Dude, I'm gonna walk one around these corners one day, and there's gonna be some dude right there, and he's just gonna go <laughs> knock me upside the head. And I'm all, oh god. Then I'm gonna freaking, I'm gonna bust him upside the head with a freaking pipe. Freaking hit me. Screw you. Oh my god. Dude. Those are really easy, because you can tell when it's the door. And it gives you a lot of time. Are you serious, dude? There is a note right there. Alright, 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 here, here. You got here. I don't want to read this right now. Just pause there. Pause there. And pause there. There. Bam. I'm not reading that. Okay? <coughs> uh, I'm breaking this wall down. <coughs> got stuff to do. I don't want to freaking be reading notes all day. Get, go through the hole, buddy. There's the fuse. That I didn't even know I needed yet. Uh, and I just assume that's where the fuse goes. Okay, I didn't even read what that door said either, but okay. Okay, okay. Find a key to unlock the main door. Jesus Christ, dude! Only one. Contains the means to continue. Tom Robinson. I think it might be this guy. I don't know yet. Detective Tom will be here soon. Do as I say. Oh, what is this guy? Called it. Oh, dude, that's nasty. Be prepared if the detective Yeah, those other dudes are lucky that I didn't no, cut them. Not again. Yet you did not learn your lesson. I'm sorry, okay, I couldn't help it. Of course you could. You chose to let your addiction consume you again and again and again. Alright, I'm just gonna keep the scap the scapule. Or I'm not even saying it right, am I? But I yeah.
All right, before I go to this next part, here's part one. I'll see you guys later.